Hi friends, it's Allison. Welcome back to AJ's Inspired Life. Welcome back to um, my 2023 year flip, okay? This is part two. I got through part one and it was just like halfway and it was like too long to do the second half. So we're gonna do it in two parts. So this is part two. If you wanna see part one, that's January through June. It's probably, you know, the video before this um, or I don't know, one or two before this, depending on how they post, but it's down below in my flipped uh, journals, flipping through journals um, playlist, okay? So we are on July of 2023. Now, most of my journals this year are approximately this size, which is nine by six. This might be a little bit bigger. This one I made out of a placemat which is um, plasticky and as much as I love it, it was a little bit hard because it's so plasticky and hard to stick to, but really, really like it. Uh, it is Junk Journal July and so the journal is made out of junk. So this is just a paper bag glued to that placemat you can see and here is the prompt list for it. Okay, here is a beautiful tag made by my Aunt Gigi and um, I normally keep them in my own little thing, but I love her so much. I just felt like she deserved a space here forever. So I hope that was the right decision because I kind of like to get them out and look at them, but I don't use them as bookmarks or anything. So I really love her with this little Julie Netting girl on it. But um, anyway, a patriotic um, little picture down there. Quote, all right, here we go. July 1st. It was a Saturday. My son, no, my daughter's uh, boyfriend was in town so they went up to a Seattle Mariners baseball game and so here's a little tuck in so although it's junk journal um although it's junk journal July I did not make this journal all out of junk okay so I try to incorporate um her um prompts into my pages but I had so much scrapbooking paper that was like patriotic or red, white, and blue themed, I really wanted to try and use it up. So it is not all made out of trash, okay? So I tried to incorporate, you can see I started marking off the prompts and then I just stopped. So I don't know, I actually know how many of these I got done and how many I didn't, but that, that was kind of the, the plan. So like prompt number one was good vibes and um, I don't know, like I just used a sticker obviously that says good vibes, okay? and. Yeah, so um, made a little note in here, like last day. So anyway, just so you know, kind of the plan here. <laughs> I love this so much. This is like, this is like my life, like a pair of flip flops and cowboy boots. That's how I know my kids are home, right? Started the day with a great walk. Yep, I honor that time so much with my gym crew. Just some pieces. I've had this, this is from Elle from years and years ago. I'm, ugh, I hold on to stuff, so... I love this journal. I love the colors. I love, um, this was just some added off of another piece of scrapbook paper that I cut out and added some of these yellow flowers throughout it. Really happy with that. All of these numbers and days are from um, Melissa. Really, really loved how that all tied it together. Um, so yeah, so the prompt Oh yeah, so like number two is pop of color. So I added the yellow, uh, number three is negative space and I journaled about um, negative space. So yeah, kind of fun. This is the inside of this card. Um, Cause it, you know, so, and I just put it here from Gigi obviously. Um, this is probably reflection or something like that is the prompt, that's why I use that. This was a prompt day. Is it Wednesday? It must be Wednesday. Yeah, prompt day. Um, oh my gosh, back pain. Here is a little journaling spot. NASCAR had a cool street course this year in Chicago. That's right. So my son had just raced in Chicago like two weeks earlier. And um, th the hotel where they were staying was setting up for it already. It would have been like right in front of it. NASCAR obviously doesn't normally race on the streets like Formula One does and uh, super cool that they did that. So note, note to self. Yeah, this is fun about work. Um, oh, my client brought in her kitty cat today. So sweet. And then we went out country line dancing this night with the kids. It was so much fun. So much fun. We had a blast. I think I, 
got, oh no, this I had already gotten. So hair appointment and Reiki healing today. Yep. So sweet. Um, yeah, my daughter had to leave that day. So she and her boyfriend drove away. That's them waving out of the car. <laughs> That's them on their way. They stopped and did cliff diving. We picked up our friend's dog to, to babysit. Gym competition that we went and supported, or I went and supported. My daughter sent a picture of her room so far. We keep sending things and like getting it delivered or whatever. She's working on it. Journal today. I'm watching the dog. Fun things, fun printables. My husband and I stretching. <laughs> My husband was having a hard day. That's the mug on my desk. It just says, you've got this. So um, I really like this page. That was a prompt page. Very happy with that. Look at just pieces of paper glued on. Not even, no journaling. No journaling. Absolutely love it. Absolutely love it. Yep. Ooh, I must be in California. How did I get in California? I did get to California. Uh-huh. There it is. Yep. Flew to California. Oh, I know why. Because <laughs> it's July. Yep. Fun journaling card in there. Picture of the water down at the house. Yep. Yep, I went down because our godson had brain surgery. Went shopping with my mom at the thrift store. We dropped off a whole bunch of stuff. And um, it's a fun little journal card on that. <laughs> my friend sent me memories from Disney. Here's a journal page or a prompt page. This is a little journaling book. I actually really enjoyed this. This was... Um, so I had bought him some flashcards at the Dollar Tree, obviously, um, to help with memory and whatnot. So I have some, and so I made like a little book, right, of, oh, I was supposed to post a pic there, but a little book of notes that I could journal about the day. Um, yeah, actually really like that. I got these stickers at the Dollar Tree, more Disney memories that day. Um, yeah, just postcards, I mean, stickers from the hospital and whatnot. My girlfriend surprised me with dinner. That was so much fun, so much fun. We, I mean, just laughed till we cried. I just needed, yeah. I snuck my friend out of the hospital. I finally got her to leave someone else to stay with her son and we went to get a hamburger. That's just our tradition. Here's day six. So I just noted the days. Um, you know, in the hospital that way. I went home um, this day. So that's me on the airplane. I'm exhausted. And then, oh, that's our savory snack. If you ever wanted to know what a savory snack is. Um, and he ended up going back into the hospital. He went home and then had to go back that night. So he was back in the, so see this? Yeah. Pretty sure I left it on the airplane that day. All right. Um, notes about the gym. This is a, a clear bag pocket. I know you can't even see it. I, I, I think that's super cool. I really like that one. Mm -hmm. Prompt page. Flip up here. So like, again, this is the prompt for Junk Journal July, whatever it was, relax, uh, balance, whatever it was. And then this is like about my day. And then this is the prompt like for the Inspired to Create Challenge. So we got a lot going on here, but um, yeah, little notes. So he came home today. Yeah, I still had more to journal, but didn't happen. Fun pages. My son and girlfriend went hiking this day. Oh, we went to a wedding this day. That was so much fun. That was really fun. Yep. 
some flips, flips. <laughs> I don't know what the prompt was, but I put that in there for that. Like I remember, yep. There's my used page for July. And then here is my calendar for July, which I really like. I like the flip out. Super fun. Okay, so that was July. I love that journal. I mean, like, yum. Um, I may not be able to get up from my desk. I'm just going to say that. Um, okay, here's August. Now, this one I did make out of scrapbook paper, expanded this binding with another piece and added two signatures. So here we go. Um, this is my normal kind of colors for August, uh, kind of blue and orange, if you will. So makes my heart happy. Um, oh my gosh, what a fun day. Yep, the family flew in um, tonight. My um, husband's dad and Gigi, uh, his aunt, flew in. <laughs> the, uh, the CrossFit games are going on and, um, and the Masters was not covered well and we people were just really mad. Here is my ballot uh, thing, and I said I completely forgot to vote. I really hate it here in Washington, if we're gonna be honest. This is my husband getting ready to go to Montana. We have a, he found a boat in our garage. I don't know where it came from. Anyway, um, he blew it up and had it in our living room to make sure it had no holes or anything. And so, and then this is just a fun piece of paper that had paint on it. Really love that in a belly band. And then here's another uh, whole thing uh, looks like a list. Finish my two day clinical supervision training. Oh, these are notes from my test that I took. Okay. Yep. Um, prompt page. Love this. Love this tag uh, that we tucked in there. Yep. Dinner. The boy was out on the water today. I was at work. I can tell you. See right here. Uh huh. Uh huh. Um, there's my girl. There's my girl. Yep. So drove to Montana right here, right? Hopped in the car at 3 a.m. <laughs> I stayed awake for an hour. I closed my eyes hard and he stopped in Spokane. I think I was asleep. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is when we met Whiskey Doodle. There's the doodle dog. Oh my God. My daughter adopted this puppy and she did not tell us. And, um, Oh, he has my heart, but yeah. So we ended up driving out. Um, Papa and Gigi flew out to Montana and then we were all there to watch the girl. Yep. And so that she's giving us a campus tour. We were supposed to go river rafting today, hence the boat. Um, it ended up raining and it was a little cold and we just decided not to go. So my son and his girlfriend went to a drive-in. They sent us that picture. We had a great tailgating. This was the weekend. This was the weekend. This is when all the teams shifted in college and it just became this mass. Oh my gosh, what a nightmare. We were following this. I mean, yeah, everybody has their own thoughts on it, I know. Here's tickets and notes from the game. There's the, there's Monty, came up and gave me a hug at the game. There's the, look at the whiskey dog in his soccer shirt. Oh my gosh, this was a day at work. A note from the gym, because I'm in my head, I need to stay in my lane. Look at this day. My favorite day at work was Tuesday, the worst day of the week. It was horrible. And um, look at this beautiful paper though, holy cow. But this is me, I look it, yep, great. Um, prompt page, no journaling, great. Minimal journaling, yeah. Ran out of plastic wrap. Um, oh, my husband and son went to the Seahawk game. I went to work, went to PT, stopped at the thrift store on the way home. My daughter is uh, at the rodeo, it looks like. We had pizza. Oh, my parents came. Great dinner. Oh. Um, mm, sorry, Eric and I hit the gym this morning. 
Hmm, this was fun. This is my son's girlfriend's birthday, so we had a little surprise for her, and then um, sorry, Ooh, sorry, I didn't know that was coming. If I can plan for it, I can do better. But it just quick. Um, that was my son's birthday. Oh, hottest day of the year. Beautiful. That's great. Um, and he went back to, he went back to school this day. Yep. All right. Notes about a chicken at work. Oh my gosh. Yep. Long day work. We got to go to the Seahawk game this night. I forgot who they were playing. Yep. Lashes. It looks like hair. What did I get done today? Uh, hair and lashes all in one day. Well, that was a chunk of change. All right. But healing. Oh, for what? So see this day, this is me when things get out of control. I decide to clean things. So, um, we went through all my shoes. Look at all the stuff we purged. Went like multiple bags, one, two, three, four, five, six, whatever, 10 bags of stuff. I went through my leggings and tank tops and then my shoes. Those are all my gym shoes. Oh, these are the gym shoes I kept. Yeah, I know. These sweet numbers here are from Jill at Jelly Bean Studio. Um, love those. Here's prompts from Lydia. So I decided this month, um, because I never get it done the first month, if I went ahead and printed them up, I'm going to use the prompts. I just use them out of order. So on a Monday, I use the Monday prompt. So the prompt was, what's your favorite movie snack? Uh, like popcorn. Yeah. Um, yeah. So anyway. Oh my gosh, this was so much fun. Mm. I got to meet Megan's daughter. She came to town. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Oh my gosh, here's my boy on his first day of his senior year of college. Isn't he a good boy? He sends me a picture with him and his roommate. Oh, I love him so much. Um, this is a fun page, prompt page. Love it. Made some buttons and a latch here. And then there is a secret compartment right there. Love that. Yeah. Prompts. Fun page. Look at the colors, you guys. Does it just not make your heart warm? Like, oh, some fun little memes, a tag with no writing on it. So, oh, yes, there is writing on it. Mm. It says, oh, Thursday's how I love you so, and I'm so glad you are the end of my week. <laughs> and then it had some more writing about it. So, perfect. Love that. Oh my gosh, this day, this was this really wonky um, cluster I made and I asked you guys, you're like, use it. And it's just getting so jacked up. But anyway, I said, Eric took me to the um, airport early because um, he had to go to work and I didn't mind. And I flew to see the girl and um, we had a great visit. Yep, she went to class. I bought a bike for $25 off Marketplace. Yep, and I checked into my Airbnb and then I was like riding the bike around. I love it. Yep. Montana, love you. Spent time with the girl. Picked up her meds. <laughs> Floated on the river. Oh, this was fun because, okay, what happened here? I got to remember. Yeah. I flew in. My husband was not going to make it. Or he wasn't going to make it till Sunday. I don't know. Something happened. And as usual, he made it. Like he drove all night, pulled in at 6 a.m. in the morning. Um, and so he was there. It was like, it was parents weekend or whatever. I don't even know. But anyway, all the parents went ra river rafting together. This isn't all of us, but that's a bunch of us. Super fun. The girl, the dog. Oh, so that was, uh, this day was Saturday, a uh, team float, parents float while the girls practice. And then we headed to the game. And then this day we're like, that was a lot of fun. Let's go back and do it again. And so, um, just our family went. So the, uh, the four of us and the whiskey doodle dog. Um, and then we went to the game. I guess they had practice this day, Sunday, and um, there was 1,973 people at their game. It was a single match attendance record for um, the University of Montana girls soccer. Pretty dang cool is what it is. Pretty dang cool. So excited. So that was us after the game. Oh, and then my husband left. He left at like, oh, dark hundred, not even joking, like 3 a.m. to drive 
my son's, that's it. I flew, he drew my son's car out and then he left early to drive down to South Carolina to drop off my son's car. And so um, this was the first day of school for my girl. So um, yeah, first day of school and there's the whiskey doodle and there's her and her boyfriend that day. Yep. And then um, after their class or whatever, uh, we went to lunch and they got me on an airplane and I went home. Yep, back to reality. My husband's on the road. Oh my gosh, here he is with Dolly Parton. He made it to Tennessee. Oh God, God, he cracks me up. And then Wednesday he was in Charleston. Crazy, crazy, crazy days. So I put tags in there. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. So he got that apartment cleaned up and got the boy moved out. Oh, my sweet girl read our favorite childhood book in her um, elementary reading class. And there's a boy of picture of my boy at breakfast with my husband. And then this was a regatta day. So my husband, <laughs> oh, he cracks me up. He found a place to watch it. There's my son and his coach. Here is the used items for the month. And there is my August calendar. Not too much documented, not too much, but I love it. I love it. I love this book. Look at the, mm, I love it all. I love it all. So, okay, that was August. I know I've said it like 10 times, a little worried. I'm not going to be able to get out of my desk. Okay, this is September. September is what? September is a book. Oh, it's a composition book. I, I, I do like a composition book. I cut this one down. Uh, it is not regular size. So it's nice and sturdy though. And then we, uh, we just put some papers on it and Mod Podge it with some glitter. Mod Podge, of course. We have some printables on the front. All right, here we go. September, beautiful, fun buttons still there. Colors for September, you know, red, green, yellow, some blue, right? Primary colors. Here is the boy in his new house day. Oh, we lost Jimmy Buffett this day. Yep, so a little ode to him. Uh, my son moved today into his new apartment and my husband left. Look at this journaling. This is when... The year starts to go a little nuts. Really love these pages too. Makes me really sad. Mm -hmm. Yep, got a fun, fun happy mail from Jenny. This was a um, an order, like a Etsy order almost. That anyway. Oh yeah, crazy days. Mm -hmm. Not a lot of journaling going on. Went to Trader Joe's on the way home. My son sent me a picture of him eating breakfast in his new apartment. I love him so much. Love him so much. Tuesday. Yeah, so I'm applying for a new job at this point. So uh, starting, yeah, so today I got the offer. Uh, super scary, but exciting. Yeah, hit the gym. Uh, using the prompt week, it looks like. Smoothie today was green. Smoothie every day is green, really. Uh, Wednesday prompt day. Here's some more of those buttons. Trying to use up printables. If you guys have any questions too, please let me know. I know I'm going through these quickly. There are, like I said, slower ones by each month. So some missed journal spots. This is just clear packaging that I made into a pocket with some receipts here. My husband at the dentist, I had lashes done today. Oh yeah, Friday smell, what smell made you happy? Um, I put anything pumpkin spice, let's, let's be real. It's September, it like comes out earlier and earlier I think every year, I don't know, I don't know. Maybe they have a limit, but like, I don't normally associate September with pumpkin spice, but I do now because they release it like September 5th or something, I don't know. Um, is this a tag? No journaling here. No journaling here. I really like this page too. That makes me sad. Look at no journaling. No journaling. Is there anything? Nothing. There's no journaling. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Going to the gym is the biggest thing I can do to stay calm and balanced and emotionally well. No joke. Um... The process of the job hunt is hard and leaving my current job involves emotional fear. Yeah. Yep. Going through it. So look at no journaling, you guys. 
literally obviously took a bath um yeah see these tags are getting a little because they've been shoved in a box loved this prompt page that was fun um pt obviously went to mcdonald's mm -hmm. and then hit the gym tonight feeling strong disney notes <laughs> the bit of honey candy and work yeah i was not happy i haven't had a bit of honey in a very long time and i was not happy with the new packaging so i had to well i had to try it and then oh my gosh did i write a note did i does this it's taped on here there's got to be a note somewhere spider spider infestation at my husband's work oh my gosh it was okay isn't this beautiful brooke um envelope right just used half as a tuck uh we're gonna say the sun was out today mm -hmm. 7 30 pt stopped for a bagel got a pedicure oh sunned out on the deck yep nice 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 more sunning we have to take the sun when we get it happy mail <laughs> chicken tacos this is like a page from obviously a mini happy planner i just glued that whole thing in it's got the tab right here uh, sometimes i use just a strip and use this as a card um, there's multiple ways to use that. So again, prescription day. So put the envelope in there. <laughs> Bath with my Epsom salts. And therapy's cool. I am blessed to do what I do for sure. <gasps> Cookies. Oh, and then there's Stuart, our bat. Yes, our little bat that lived in our room. My husband left for work for a couple weeks. I had coffee out on the deck. Yep. Creepy page. Creepy page with my new cut apart book. Um, yoga tonight. <gasps> Those were delicious. The boy is sailing. Oh, this was that happy meal of that cute, adorable kit. And I used it right here. Uh, yoga, coffee walk. Yep. Yep. They made it to nationals. They're going to finals. Oh. Hmm. Oh, happy daughter's day. Okay. This is the day. So what is today? The 25th of September. Surrender to what is, let go of what was and have faith in what will be. I'm going to tape the edge of this. This paper is very old. It was from Happy Mail and it is it is ripping and i don't want it to rip more um this is the day i quit my job i gave notice today for four weeks it was emotional and draining mm -hmm. and then i went and donated blood and then i had chinese food <laughs> today i told my clinical team that i was leaving yeah it's okay to be a mess yep so here comes, yep, here, here comes the craziness. This was a prompt page. That was fun. Look at, here's my notes about the day. We worked and then I did some journaling. That's it, folks. Okay, rain day today. Oh, my husband drove out and saw my girl play. I could not go. I could not call out sick like two days after I gave notice. Like I just couldn't. In hindsight, I should have, but I couldn't. Like I just, yeah, so... Uh, here's the team recognition. Look at this fun page. Obviously got fall flowers for the porch today at Trader Joe's. Little note. Ending the month in the beginning stages of leaving my job. Yep. Incredibly hard. I love this paper though. Look at this color, you guys. Oh, there's my used items for the month. Oh, there's an empty bottle of Sparkle Mod Podge. Look at all the stuff we use this month. What fun. And then there's the calendar. I love a good comp book, um, especially the grid. I don't know if I, you can see that. It's, um, see the grid. I love the grid comp books. 
and I did enjoy cutting it down um, a little bit. I'm gonna I'm gonna save this one because I'm gonna fix that one page. All right, that was September. This is October. This is an old journal that I pulled out the pages from. I used the outside obviously and and um, put our pages in and it's fat. It's one signature. Yeah, so added my skull beads to the outside. Here we go. Fun pages. This is more like nine. I don't know what it is. <laughs> it's not nine by six. I don't have a ruler. It's smaller. Um, these, all these were made by Melissa. Super cute. I like the themey colored uh, things. I know not everybody does. Banana tape. I love it. Yep. And a little quote. And then I started counting days with bananas that she sent me. 11 more days until I leave. <laughs> so here I have a little note. I finished all my um, paperwork for the background check for my new job. Not a lot of journaling. I mean, literally, there's four lines here, five lines. Like, obviously had coffee, a little quote here. I love this page, though. Not a lot going on in terms of journaling, though. Prompt page starting like this is a quote there I'm just really trying to ground myself every morning with some readings or you know whatever and so if something stood out to me I put it there right here slept in the change in schedule has benefits oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah because <laughs> oh yeah I'm now part-time yeah mm -hmm. here's a note what did I do here oh it flips down this way yep fun flips love it thrift store quote love it I do like looking at old journals I mean these aren't even that old look that that back in the house um they're not even that old but you can kind of see different trends that I was doing or like ideas or inspiration if you will yep good call with mom and dad wishing them well on their trip oh so sunny laid out we're in October October 7th and I wore my new Halloween leggings. <laughs> so there you have it. Yep. Good sausages, yoga, bat in the house. Oh, favorite punch. This one's pretty cool, though. This punch is pretty cool. Um, oh, I got my new leggings. Oh, this was a little drawing from one of my clients. Got my new leggings. This is fun. It was just an envelope we glued in, like, sideways. Didn't It doesn't really serve a purpose, but... Um, prompt page. I love this. Got a message that my blood was used. I love that. Bat in the house. Five more days. Um, bought lunch for one of my interns. Bat in the house. Oh, and my husband swished him out with a broom and it made me sad because that was the last time we saw him. Slept in. I can tell you right here. Slept in, zero gym, zero yoga. <laughs> My son got his passport today. Fun little pocket. Oh, we went for a walk. These amazing mushrooms were growing. I love it so much. Put some journaling cards in here. Made some, I don't even think, yep, they're just paper. I mean, this one's um, the notes, and then this one's just paper for, like, decoration. Daughter uh, in Colorado for soccer today. Look at that mushroom. It's like art. So dang cute. Um, yeah, I like this idea. The piece of paper I wasn't going to use that I absolutely love in the middle of the journal. Fun prompt page. <laughs> it's my face when I was going into work that day. Oh my gosh. So many emotions. <laughs> this is what, yeah, one more day. One more day. And then here is my last day at work. They had a nice little dinner and new beginnings are often disguised as painful endings. Yep. And then a little quote and little note. Um, oh, artwork by one of my clients. A little dinner with my team. Um, oh, that's right. And then we left this morning for Montana. Oh my gosh, we left the next day. Yep. And I got a call on our way. I put, I'm officially unemployed 
for real though. Um, I wish I would have known that quite frankly, but anyway, um, here is a, this is kind of cool. I like this a lot. Actually, this is a wrapper off of a beer can. Like they're not printed on the metal. It's an actual sticker and it just peels off. So we drove to Montana, met the girl, of course, for pizza and uh, walked across to Big Dipper ice cream, which is in the travel magazine. I cut it out knowing we were going to go there. And there we are right there, at Big Dipper ice cream. So I put, hello, you. She makes my day. Oh my God, the fall in Montana. Oh, there was leaves everywhere. It was amazing. Absolutely loved it. We went to the thrift store. Here's our receipt. Oh my gosh, $114 of, of mostly Grizzware, quite frankly. Um, here is my boy and his team on the alumni. Here is the soccer, soccer weekend highlights. Let's see, this is, um, I had a slow morning and then I went into work to, we drove home after this, after the game, we drive home and then get home late. And then, yeah, I had to go in and clean out my office this day and like pack everything up. Yep. My daughter and her boyfriend went hunting. Another picture from my girlfriend at Disney. Yep. All academic team. And there's the boy and he likes his new sweater. I bought him. I'm not too sure he really does, but she sent me this picture. Look how stinking cute that dog is in his sweater. Um, this page is a hot mess, but it is what it is. Um, my son got his new wax melts today. So I glued one in here. It's not his, but this is one I had. This material we had stapled on because I really wanted to use it and it looked kind of fun, but then I wasn't in love with it. And so I put this big pineapple on here. That was the bomb, the bath um, bombshells I used that night, obviously. Gosh, this, <laughs> I've used her so many times. Yeah. Decision becomes clearer and clearer, like for leaving my job. Uh, prompt page, super fun one. I really liked that one actually. Yep. Dill pickles, sunflower seeds. <laughs> yeah, quotes again, and just some sticky stuff. Bat. Is the bat back? I can't remember. I don't think so. I have to think about this for a minute. Um, I was at Target today, though, and they had this was like on the counter and I was just laughing and I picked it up and I sent it to my husband. And I was like, mm, just in case, because at this point, like I've been hired at my new job, but I don't have a start date. I'm still waiting for all the clearance. I'm still waiting for all the background checks, all the stuff to clear. And so anyway, um, yeah, still haven't heard about the due date. I mean, the date, the start date. Yeah. So anyway, mm. I'm done with notes, all the business, and I'm logged out, and I sent my final email to the board. Yep, I'm done. Done forever. All right. Yep, my dad went in for COVID today. I knew that one was coming, so I'm okay. Um, I didn't flip these actually too long ago, so um, cool football game. Yeah, I'm sad we didn't get to go. My daughter uh, and her team got out, got to go out on the football um, field today and get recognized. So, yeah, house cleaning and clutter. Got some journaling done. Good workout tonight. And then <laughs> I put my mood board. Oh, my God. Yeah. Came home from work or my husband came home from work. Oh, I went, this is a Sunday. Yeah, it sure is. I went and picked up wood today. Um, he got home. I needed the truck. And then I went to my friend's house and loaded it full of wood. And I could not believe she gave it to us for free. So anyway, that was pretty cool. Um, let's see, Monday, ortho appointment. Yep, I'm good to go. No surgery. He's approved. Like, he's just like, keep PT in it. You're making amazing progress. And there's no need to do surgery right now. Unless you want to, we'll do an MRI and then we'll talk about it later. And I was like, peace out. I got to go. So um, the prompt again. So here I did the same thing with Lydia's prompts. It's always the first week of the month. If I don't use them and I've printed them, I just put them on random days. So this was Monday. I put it on a Monday, the 30th. And it says document 
everything you drank today. So I put two cups or mugs of coffee, a gallon of water. I had my fizz. I had my mind. I had gut energy and gut and energy drinks in it. There's my, oh, look at my crew on Halloween. This day I was actually filming. I remember very clearly because we went to the gym and we decided to go earlier than later and I had to get ready very quickly. So I just like went as a dead zombie person. Um, and then there is my calendar for the month. Again, not too much going on. I do like the colored background paper. I know that was the first time we did that, I think. And that was fun. And then here, where's my used? Oh, there it is. My used items. I like that. So that was October. And I do like it because it has a band. Okay, we have two more months to go. You guys don't hear from me in a while it's because I can't get out of my craft room all right this is November and I'm super in love with this journal this journal I actually bought um, and I don't know from who it was online and um, not on Etsy and I bought it a while ago and I'd never used it and I saved it I was like oh I think it's perfect for November it is a piece of scrapbook paper with a single signature and you can see it's completely overstuffed so Let's see. Um, and I've added some things and I've taken away some things. This pocket was here. This pocket was here, but it was like pink floral and stuff. And so I covered it with a napkin. Um, yeah. Oh gosh. I love this journal. Okay. So prompt page. This is a fun pocket that was in here. Um, this is like wax paper kind of. So I went ahead and journaled on it maybe baking paper, right? Here's our trip to um, Charleston, Dia de, de los Muertos. So I noted that with some incense um, packaging for my sticks. I voted, I turned in my thing today, I didn't forget this time. Here's a fun um, corner pocket. So I put some stuff in there. We're down in Charleston, here's a little gift bag that I had and um, why does this always get stuck? There it goes. I made a journaling card in here. I guess I won't. It gets stuck on the inside of this right here where those straps are glued in. It catches. So, um, yeah. Some museum tags because this is actually a museum now. And so we got to watch the races from up here on the deck. The regatta was right here. Super fun. This is a soccer field. My daughter's team was down in Arizona for their regionals. Um, or yeah, regionals, I guess. I mean, a beautiful day out on the water. It's stunning. It's absolutely stunning. A side pocket here with some tucks. Beautiful crane out on the dock. I laid out, my husband went and watched the last day and then we had um, food in the bar. Oh, I went to yoga on the beach. They have free yoga, mm, it was amazing. Here is a beautiful tuck spot. This is stretchy lace, which I've never used before, but I really liked it. Um, let's see, so I glued that in, a parking ticket, I guess. And then we, here's our checkout information from the hotel. And then we went to Savannah for the day. And I journaled a little bit about that. And then we decided from there to head wet, no, east to the beach, to Tybee, which was amazing. And we loved it. And, um, mm, yep, my son was named Elite 18th, highest GPA. And um, we went to a place called AJ's. It was amazing. Here's a whole little map of Tybee. I just tucked it all in it would obviously unfold, but the whole map's right there. We dropped into a CrossFit box, super fun. And there is our hotel key. Went for coffee the next morning. Again, if you want more details and stuff, the whole flip through is, you know, below. So I'm not gonna go through. Here's a map here with a funny story. They had an outdoor shower, which is pretty cool with an old surfboard. There's my cousin we went to visit. Uh, dropped in to see them in um, in Georgia. We went to another CrossFit box this day, dropped in there. We went to the Black Rifle Coffee Company store, which is totally cool because we buy their coffee all the time, but it was fun to actually, 
like they have an actual store so this was the um oh it was prompt day oh, it was the eighth this is our anniversary <laughs> i'm not even paying attention this was our anniversary we went back to the Tybee Beach um, after much, much uh, didn't know where we were going. We went back to Tybee Beach. We went riding bikes for a long time. Um, saw my niece, excuse me, and her roommate. And then went for a really nice dinner and then a walk on the beach and a little ice cream. Happy 26 years to us. Little corner tuck here with some amazing breakfast and uh, a little note about our day. And then we went to, someone recommended this oyster shop. So we um, went back to Charleston, grabbed our boy and um, went there. It was fabulous. We went for a fabulous walk on the beach and um, walked around the cistern with, it has all the lights. It's not a great picture, but there's my boy. It's gorgeous. It is gorgeous. That campus is stunning. Um, he had some school events to go to. We went to another beach, went walking beautiful sand dollars everywhere, had a beautiful coffee. And then we met him for dinner that night after his event. He was so handsome in his blazer and tie. Um, beautiful uh, French, yep, French dinner. Oh my gosh, he's our little foodie. So we dropped a pretty, pretty penny there. And the next morning we met him for breakfast. We took him to grab a quick breakfast and then we headed off to the airport. We grabbed Chick-fil-A and it's veterans day so i made a quick little veterans thing here's our parking thing oh and here's pictures our daughter sent us of um montana <laughs> they went hunting again and uh she's getting to know this horse a little bit so so beautiful all right so there's that uh yeah we dropped into crossfit before we left another crossfit box there super fun here is Sunday. Oh, that's so nice. We came home. That's right. We came home on a Saturday, I guess. Yep. And then we had Sunday to decompress. Yep. Easy, calm day trying to catch up. Absolutely love that. Um, it's always nice to have more time with people, but then it's also nice to have a little bit of a day to get your head back on. So because um, I like this little piece of paper I glued in here to kind of reinforce the seam and, you know, printables, that sort of thing. Um, because today is my first day at my new job. <laughs> so I put, don't be afraid. This is me out on the porch having my coffee. Beautiful bookmark from Sweet Janet a while ago. Um, UPS with my package of my computer and everything because everything was online. The, the, all the new trains that, you know. Um, yep, fun pocket here. Put some stuff in here, a tag. This is a beautiful printout from um, Brooke because she sent me pumpkin spice donut goldfish I don't even know it was like crack is what it was it was pumpkin spice crack crackers is what it was and I ate them all every one of them I didn't share them I don't think I shared them I might have shared a little bit with my husband I'm not too sure I don't think I did uh they were delicious so thank you again uh, so uh first day first day on the job and um oh my gosh it was so sweet it was so sweet Yep, trusting the process that changes what I need right now. This is unlike anything I've ever done. So um, yeah, so prompt pages, I'm now putting these prompts in the back of my book because there was no room for them in here. So I put the prompt in here and the prompts will go in the back. Um, went to Subway and uh, my husband didn't go to the gym. I am going as much as possible for the bod squad. So I was going like literally every day. Um, beautiful picture of our harbor today. I mean, stunning in the fall. Yep. Life begins at the end of your comfort zone. This doesn't work. This is not us. This is a picture out of a magazine, but like from the district, I was cracking up, but like we did it also. That's just not us in the picture. Look at the sunset. Look at the sunset. It is stunning. It takes my breath away. Yep. Home is where your heart is. My boy is home. My boy is home. I love it so much. Yep. So this is me like at work, fun little journaling spots here, doing bod squad, riding the bike, all sorts of fun, little tuck thing. Oh, and there's a picture from the football game. My daughter went to the Grizz football game. A note about, uh, or a tuck about water, the water from Trader Joe's I was drinking. Another pocket here. 
got rowing time done eating the crisp bread crackers here's a little button thing yep week three in bod squad it's a tough week <laughs> week three is the tough week um Yep, it's all right. It has only changed and I am safe, like on so many levels. Dear goodness. Here's another little journal flip. Yep, a little paper clip. That's fun. I love this ribbon. I love, it's like antique. It reminds me of Holly Hobby that was sewed in here. It's so cute. Um, so when is my girl home? I don't know. My girl got home. When's my girl home? I don't know. She's home here. I see her right here in this picture. So, um, Eric and I went to the gym. My kids hit the, the local bar for a uh, bingo night. Don't know. This is our little front porch entry. Um, I don't know. My daughter got home. I know my son came home first, so uh, love today giving thanks and then I just like this is all just here's the prompt for today it's Friendsgiving it might be my favorite holiday of the year I'm not too sure I love that my house is full of like whoever wants to come quite frankly but there's always like 15 kids here to eat and I love listening to them and hearing them and and they all just run in the house they just open the door and drop their shoes and I love them so much they are beautiful young adults and we are honored to be a part of their life and that they share it with us. It is so cool. Uh, Thanksgiving day, we did the turkey trot. Um, that was fun. And oh, and then for the first time ever, we went to the Seahawk game. We got tickets. Um, we got tickets and they were playing. Um, they were playing San Francisco 49ers, which is the rest of my family's favorite team. And so um, I did wear the jersey for the family and my team was already out. So this is a very old tag, by the way, uh, like a return tag. But anyway, um, yeah, so we went there. It was it was super fun. And um, but yeah, I was I had to put my cowboy hat on. But look at Dolly. Look at Dolly at the cowboy halftime show. Oh, my God. Love her. OK. That was amazing. This is from our wristbands from the halftime show. Oh, and then, um, yeah, the pictures on the back already show. Okay. Uh, oh, daughter and I went to Goodwill. We found some goodies. I got these new stamps. And then napkins. My son left today to what? Yes, they went up for the game, the local college game, the big Apple Cup right there. And then we had to say goodbye to our roux for dinner. It's always sushi. We had a beautiful board of sushi. And then Sunday, uh, the boy left. And um, our daughter drove him to the airport on her way back to school. Mm -hmm. A good talk with my girlfriend. Yep, already missing my kids. A little sad. A little sad. Uh, getting organized. Oh, here's a thing. Picture of Rue. I still, yep. See, so this is a good example. This is like this blue color, which I don't really do. Like it doesn't look like November to me. So I just flipped it over and I was going to use the brown. I don't know if I still have this. Um, I'm going to try one more time, you guys. I'm going to leave it on my desk. Okay. Little notes here crazy days trying to be dialed in on food and hitting the gym through the holiday time another pocket here learning oh my gosh the learning curve at this job you guys filled with gratitude this is that fun paper love it and then just put this on the back prompt for the week there's no journaling here yep just staying motivated at the gym put some i mean mm-hmm Fun pockets, little tags of stuff. Did I even journal? I didn't. And it's just so dang cute. I'm going to leave it in there. I'm going to leave it in there. Um, little notes. And there's my, there's my little tiny journal for the month. Is it not a journal calendar? Is it not adorable? I love it. I love it so much. And then I documented, where did I document my used items? what what did i do oh there they are there's the used items 
and then there's the calendar so this piece didn't get used which is kind of a bummer because it's really pretty I added this in it did not have enough pages and so I added this piece and this piece in okay and then it had a pocket in the back so I just added this and this is where I tucked all my journaling um, prompt cards that I made for the month okay and you can see that either in the flip or in um, the Inspired to Create playlist down below as well. Okay, here we go. Here's December. Oh my gosh, with all of its yumminess, these are things I found or tags or whatever. Scrapbook paper, not super strong. Do you see how it's already pulled and wonky? So I probably should have used a little different one. I wrapped this ribbon all the way around the outside to tie it and didn't do eyelets. This is scrapbook paper just cut out. Okay, here we go the end of 2023. This was a gift. This whole journal, no, half of the journal, the front half was a, a journal gift, an envelope journal. And I wanted to use it, but it was not big enough to uh, cover the whole month for me. And so I made a second signature. You can see those obviously right there and then made this journal. Okay. So it is super fun. I tried to kind of match some of it and I took out a lot of the pieces um, I glued in a lot of pieces and then I took out a lot of pieces and tried to disperse them through the second half so it's more flowy and fluid. Fluid. I don't know the word. I, I, I never find the word. But look how cute this is, okay? Um, and again, not a lot of journaling. So there's um, like our coffee cup from the day from our walk, the whiskey dog in the snow, these are from Melissa, these uh, ornament numbers. That's my daddy's birthday. Hmm. Notepad notes, journal notes, gem notes. Oh, my boy came home this day. Oh, so exciting. Yeah, they were just here for Thanksgiving and now they're home for Christmas or he's home at least early. Um. Yeah, super fun. So I made some like little tuck cards up here. Cards this way. What did I do? This one goes this way. Happy Friday. It's taped in. And then this one I just tucked in this way. All right. Montana had a playoff game. Go Grizz. Oh my gosh, this is Saturday. We had a great workout. My boy went with me to do the burpee challenge. And then we had a partner workout. And so... Yeah, that was fun. And then we went to pancakes <laughs> and then San Francisco played. So he and my husband got to watch football together, which is just, they just love it up. I, mm, I just love it so much. So a little bit of journaling here. This is not, yeah, I didn't even journal. I just tucked this in. Not a lot of journaling. Yep. Oh my gosh. This is the night we went, <laughs> we had a canned food challenge at work and we were going to lose and uh yeah we don't like losing so they were like venmoing me money late uh costco closes at 10 for anyone who wants to know my husband and i were there till about 9 48 um getting two of these things of food and then taking it back to the gym um yeah and then my daughter and her boyfriend had their last final today so that was their little school pick they sent so i just made these tags put the chipboard on that sort of thing um little cup of cheer, hot cocoa, and a bath. Nice. Little envelope here with some notes and tags in here from Christmas or like a gift, a Christmas shirt I got that I wore. <laughs> this is our squirrel proof bird feeder. And he is literally sitting there like it's a buffet. I'm just dying. Um, football, they ended up winning, but at halftime it was scary. So, um, this can't be right. This isn't right. This isn't right. Shoot. Why is this not right? I have to figure this out. That This is not right. Mm. Okay. I have to fix that. That's not right. I gotta, I don't know what I did there. I gotta look at that. Okay. Um, here's our girl coming home with the doodle dog in the back seat. Tuesday the 19th. Oh, like a sad note kind of behind here. I had my pumpkin. Oh my gosh. Pumpkin spice protein bars. Yum. This was a little ornament. One of the kids at school made me so dang cute. 
a flip up. We went to the gym and then we went out for like dinner that night because it's the holidays and like we weren't going to see each other maybe. Um, oh, because we had, what, what, I know. Hold on. There's a day here. Hold on. Oh, oh, I know because th this is one page a day. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I get it now. Is it not? Yep. 17th and 18th. Instead of one whole spread for a day, it's one day, one day. So um, I was like, why is that happening so fast? This is a Tuesday. This is a Wednesday. That's right. Okay. Thursday, last day. Oh, no, not quite. But oh my gosh. Yep. I came home from work to bake all my stuff for work and my oven was dead. Like dead, dead. So that was fun. Um, finished a bag of coffee this morning. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Mm, crazy. Um, uh, fun workout. We always do the 12 days of Christmas at the gym. Went shopping with my girl for Christmas. This is, uh, so I worked up until the 22nd and this is the first day I went shopping for Christmas on the 23rd. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's how I roll. Here is the, um, ice cream thing. You guys have seen this before. It's my husband's birthday. My daughter made him like a little cheese board, not like a charcuterie. Anyway, it says 55 on it. Oh my God. I love him so much. Okay. Um, we went walking this morning down in the, down in the Harbor. It's a horrible picture of me, but he found this amazing picture of a Santa rock because people leave them out in the community, like the painted rocks. This is a beautiful card. This whole thing was Christmas. Lots of tags in here. And the doodle dog got like one box of toys. <laughs> I got these really cool slotted spoons, so I used the tag from that. Lots of fun things. Um, got hunting gear. My daughter got hunting gear. I got this from my godson. Um, yeah, beautiful um, die cut envelope. Oh my gosh. And then the next day, my husband's dad and aunt came up, and so uh, Papa and Gigi were here. And yeah, game night, of course, of course, that night involves date night, not date night, game night immediately. Um, let's see, made some good couscous the next day. <laughs> we gave my son's um, girlfriend her Christmas present and it was like kind of a joke. Um, we went to a really fun like band night at a local restaurant with my husband's cousin, his aunt's son, who lives close to us. The next day, uh, I went with my daughter to get her hair done. They went and did miniature golf and um, pool. And my husband and I went to his company dinner, Christmas dinner. Oh my gosh, this was the 30th. My boy and his girlfriend left for St. Croix. And uh, Papa and Gigi left to go home. And so they met each other at the airport. And this is New Year's. So when, where's my girl? I feel like my girl left already. She did. Where is she? I have to have a note in here. I don't know. She must be somewhere. Oh, she took him to the airport. Yeah. She took him to the airport and headed back to school. And then my husband and I on New Year's, yeah, we went to the gym. We had a good walk. Um, <laughs> um, yeah, slow night. We ended up watching Mission Impossible 6. Finally, finally Tom makes the journal, but that's literally how we roll. We were like done. New Year's Eve done. We were in bed, I think at 1030 probably. Um, yeah. So, and I just, I just think it's cool. I made a little note today that the date today was one, two, three, one, two, three. So, uh, I just think that's fun. So that's that. Here is the December journal that I put in the back there and that journal, I keep saying that calendar and then why do I keep missing? Oh, I didn't document it. Did I? It should go right here. My used supplies. I only had like three. Okay. So this journal has to stay out also because I still have to do that with you. And here are my journaling prompt cards for the month, all four. So those are fun. I will do my used supplies right here. I had like three of them. Yep. 
Yeah, crazy. And that is the year, you guys. So if you want to see the whole stack, because I know this is part two, if you want to see the whole stack, you have to go back to part number one to see all 12 of them lined up. I will try and take some pictures and post them on Instagram. But um, I mean, like what fun, what fun to have the memories. Some days are documented better than others. And that is life. So I'm grateful for this community. I'm grateful for the sharing of ideas and um, inspiration always from you guys. So thanks for hanging out. Let me know your thoughts on uh, the year. Let me know what yours, your year looked like last year. Are you going to make changes this year? Are you doing something different? So far, I'm on the same track of like one, <laughs> one giant journal a month. I don't know. I don't know. We'll have to see if... Um, not all my journals are this big. Like they're getting bigger through the years. That's obvious. So let me know your thoughts and let me know. I don't know. Let me know. Let's talk. Okay. Thanks for being here, you guys. I hope you're having great journaling days. I hope you're documenting whatever it is that happens in your days, whether that's just your thoughts or activities or weather, food, whatever it is. Um, I would love to hear it. So keep me posted. I appreciate you being here and I hope you find something today that inspires you. Take care.